Hey everyone, it's New York Beauty XOXO. I'm here with another video. Uh, just ignore the background. It's kind of whack. I'm in my new house. Whoa! I can't believe it. Um, I'm on my laptop, so it's a little crazy. Um, I just wanted to show you really fast a haul that I had collectively from when I was living with my mom. Um, I don't know if you can really see my makeup. It actually came out good. I'm wearing, um, Cherish by MAC, and then on top I'm wearing, what is it? Peach Stock Lip Gloss from one of those collections, if you could see the, um, the top. Anyway, um, comment down below if you recognize this necklace and you know where it's from. It's an oldie. Comment down below. Um, anyway, uh, let's get on to the haul. I have a bag of Sephora. It's not all from Sephora. Maybe like a couple products. Um, okay. I went to Sephora. I went to Walgreens, Rite Aid, CVS for this stuff. Lush. Um, and I think that's it. But I'll start off with like Rite Aid. I think I mentioned in like my last like update video that I've been doing like the matte because I have such oily skin. I'm doing the BB cream for oily skin. It's a matte one. And then the powder, which is, um, it says it's just clean cover girl. And um, I'm really liking this combination. I'm actually wearing this right now, except I didn't put the powder on. I just wore this because I did want like a, I don't know, like a dewy kind of, um, I don't know, look. Anyway, so I've been loving these and I got that at Rite Aid. I also got on one trip to like Walgreens or Rite Aid, I thought this was the highlighter everybody wanted, and it isn't. It's an Illuminating Palette um, by Wet n Wild. I couldn't find the other ones. It's kind of like a shimmer brick, but I do like it. It was $4.99, and um, I enjoy it. It's not bad. I mean, I have a lot of highlighters, but this isn't that bad, and I'll probably use this. Am I going to search for the other one anymore? Probably not. On another trip, I got the Wet n Wild um, Face Spray. It's like a setting um spray and I love these because I um I am forced to go on the playground with the kids so I really don't use this to set my makeup I use it more just as um, a refresher and when I run out of my others I use this so I haven't used it that often because I do have others I got um let's see what else I got one thing from MAC I got a new lipstick um this is a matte and I tend to love my mattes um I went there with nothing in mind because I have a collection of MAC lipsticks like nobody else. Um, it's called When Men Love Mystery. I went there and I just kept gravitating towards this purple color. And um, I'll swatch it. Not like my camera's that great but on my laptop. But um, it's a matte purple. I really like it. I wore it a few times. I don't have anything like it, believe it or not. I don't know if it's limited edition or a new color. Um, I'm kind of out of the loop of MAC lipsticks, but I really do like this. Um, let's see. I did get, um, on another trip to like a drugstore place, I got the Delicious um, CoverGirl lipstick. This is like equivalent to like, I feel like the Maybelline ones. Um, and I'll swatch it also. This is kind of just like a mauve nude. And um, I think uh, Kaylee uh, on YouTube, she she loves it from a long time ago. And I love Kaylee. So uh, another thing I got was a backup of Mauve Out of Here by Wet n Wild. I love this lipstick. It's $1.99. I'll swatch it next to the um, CoverGirl one to give you just an idea. It's on the end. And um, I get a lot of compliments when I wear it. So I just got a backup because I was in there and I was like, what the heck? Uh, what else did I get? Um, let's move on to the higher end. I went to Sephora and I had a ton of points. So I got the Bobbi Brown um, face cream. It's not the eye cream. It's the face base and it's spectacular. I'll probably get a full size when I'm done. I got a sample because I've tried this before and it didn't work out for me because it was summer. But I think I'm going to use it more um, in September going into October. It's the um, Lancome, the Idol 24-hour makeup. Um, I want to give it a shot again. 
I really want to like this makeup because I like Lancome products and um, I heard it's amazing for oily skin so I'm going to give it another shot. While I was there, I picked up the um, Better Than Sex Mascara, the mini, because I'm rotating out so many mascaras right now. And I just asked the girl, the makeup artist, about it, and she said she did like it. So I said, let me just, you know, try it. I haven't opened it yet. I also got myself some of the um, Clinique Take the Day Off um, Cleanser Balm. I was in the store, and I, just, I had, um, I haven't even opened it yet because I have other things I'm using right now, but... um. I did use some of it because I had so many swatches all over my hands because I was in Sephora for literally an hour waiting for my dog to come out of the vet for like a procedure and I was in the mall for two hours. So I was like, let me get all these swatches off and it worked amazing and I think it was on Nicole Guerrero's channel. But anyway, um, I really like this product. I just haven't gotten into it yet. Um, I went to, oh, I got another thing uh, just at the counter at Sephora. She gave me... Um, it says thank you on it, so it was like pre-packaged just to throw in people's bags because I'm one of those like rouge, whatever, spend way too much money on makeup kind of a girl. This product is a Skin Care IQ Regenerating Cleanser, and it's, uh, I haven't even tried it yet. Um, yeah, I haven't tried it yet. Anyway, I also went to Lush in the same trip to the mall, and... Um, I got this, which I never saw before, and I'm loving, I want to open this up. It's just called Gold. It looks like cookie dough. <laughs> it was on sale for $11. It expires, like, at the end of the summer, like, into September, but um, you just break it off. It's, like, kind of like a bubble bar. You break it off, and uh, you put it in your bath, and it has sparklies that, that are gold. You could see. Um, I also got a sample of Herbalism face wash, which is great for oily skin, if you didn't know, and I have it in my shower right now. So I'm excited to get into this. I should have gotten two. Um, I love anything almond scented, and it does smell like almonds. The girl was like, you'll love this, and get it now because it's like going, going, gone. So I grabbed it. I think that's it for now. There's a pair of pants I wanted to show you, but they're like way over there. Um... Yeah, I think that's it. Um, let's see. I don't know if I showed you these sunglasses. I really like these. And I want to do a favorites on like fashion, clothing, and things like that. Um, I did cut my hair a little shorter. I'm thinking about, okay, comment down below. I'm thinking about growing out my Japanese, cutting it a little bit shorter because it's going to be curly. Um, maybe do like a side swept bang and make it blonde. Let me know. <laughs> um, anyway, if you've used any of these products, if you have any recommendations on any new products or anything in that nature, uh, comment down below because I've been out of the um, makeup loop for a while. I did actually did my makeup differently because I feel like I haven't done it like a full face in so long. I used the Too Faced Country Palette, and um, I used something different on my brows. Um, I used uh, Becca Opal Liquid Highlighter, and um, the nudes don't really show up on me on my MacBook. But anyway, this is my room. This is my beauty room. My vanity fits perfect in that little cubby hole below the window. I'm going to get curtains. The paint is called Iced Mauve Benjamin Moore. It's way more purpley taupe than what it's showing up and um I'll give you a tour of my room soon it is a disaster <laughs> um along with my whole house we're having a hard time getting settled because we have different people coming different days like one person's working on the basement someone's cutting down trees I had appliances come yesterday um just a lot of crazy things my dog had to have an uh outpatient procedure in the meantime where he had to go back for multiple like checkups you know and whatnot so I've been super crazy plus plus I found out my job is like closing so right after I buy a house so that's really great um the building's being auctioned off so I had to get a new job which is good I got the same hours the same pay same distance from home people seem really nice fingers crossed um I have nothing on my nails 
And I'm super white for it being summer, but my summer has been pretty chaotic. When you buy a house, there's so much that goes into it. It's like insane. Um, and that's it. I look super old in this, uh, the way I um, have that angle. It looks terrible. And um, I'm actually starting to lose weight. Um, thank the Lord. Uh, I eat the same thing. I think it's just like my cortisol, cortisol, cortisone, no cortisol. Like they, like, I feel like my body knows I'm stressed and just says, okay, I'm going to take what you normally eat and I'm going to turn that sucker into fat and like plaster it all over your body because you are so stressed out. Um, but on a normal basis, I'm usually like a seven, eight, nine, ten, And I was like my like 13, 14 was like tight. I'm like, oh my gosh, I had to go out and buy new clothes, which is like crazy because I'm like vegan and like, uh, hello, like I eat like nothing. But as soon as like the move happened and I started to feel better inside, like happier, um, the pounds just like disappeared. It's so weird how my body's so in tune to my mind. Um, comment down below if you know what I'm talking about that um, I'm just shedding weight. So I don't know. I'll take it. Um, so anyway, now I'm starting to fit back into my clothes. Uh, anyway, so um, also um, I want to do like a um, I'm going to do a favorites video for the summer since I pretty much missed out on doing videos for so long. Um, but I have a lot of favorites, um, some health favorites and fashion and some beauty. So anyway, I'm going to film that soon. Maybe I'll switch up this makeup because I'm looking washed out. Um, okay, bye guys. Uh, this is New York Beauty XOXO back again. And um, the summer in New York has been brutal. I don't know about um, anywhere else. But anyway, have a great day. Happy Saturday.